calling you a radical, so this is a big breaking story. So they said thousands, many thousands of tons of fish wash up dead on the Baja Peninsula in Mexico on the Pacific. We're talking maybe billions of fish. I mean, probably everything that's left in the Pacific. So, stay with me. Finally, a fisherman says, the interview head of the Mexico Fishing Alliance there, he says it's hot water. He says it's a hot water current coming from Japan. It's exactly what it is. These suns have burrowed into the Pacific Ocean and they're into the Japanese. So the reactors of Fukushima, Japan, there's a little eddy right there and it goes right into the Japanese current. The Japanese current comes over here right direct hit right to Eugene, Oregon right there. It splits. Part of it curls up into Bristol Bay, but the vast majority, and especially this time of year, it goes into the California it runs very tight on the California coast, the Baja. It's exactly what it is. These cores are in the fucking ocean. They're in the Japanese current. They're suns. This isn't Chernobyl. This isn't Mayaka. This isn't Santa Susana. And those are motherfuckers. This is a fucking catastrophe unforeseen in the history of mankind. So he says it perfectly. Exactly. It's what it is. It's a hot water current that's coming from Japan. Now, what happened to Japan? Well, that was 10 years ago. Okay. Just like the sewer. Oh, it's just 70 million gallons. It happened worse in 88 or 98. We had to, oh, okay. Right into the current. There's so many people dying. Del Mar opens tomorrow, and I always think back. I'll never forget this. I was in Del Mar a couple years back, and I was at a dog beach. Charlie and Mimi, I call it. Remember you wrote Charlie? I called it the Charlie and Mimi. I did those videos. Charlie and Mimi. It got reported in the media in Del Mar, a two-year-old who'd been playing right there at the dog beach in the ocean got sick. It was E. coli. Died. This happens up and down all the fucking time, but yet yeah, used to have sirens up along there. I talked to the fucking desal plant today. We didn't even know about it for two fucking days. Did you shut it off? What are you getting in the water? Oh, it's good. It's all good. I believe you. I believe you. I believe you. They took down the sirens. They took out the warning signs. They took them all down. Tourism economy, that's all anybody gives a fuck. You trade in your health. You could go to the average Echo Boomer baby. Say you went to the average, let's say, 40 year old, 35 year old, 45 year old. Says, I'll give you $3 million right now, but you'll be dead in 10 years. 99% of them would take it. There's no doubt in my fucking mind. They were fucking perfect. What a generational arrogance bunch of motherfuckers this one is. I mean, I've always said the definition of religion is generational arrogance. That this is over the fucking top. Zionists going to take the planet with them. The Mormons are, oh, they are Zionists going to take it. Evangelicals, wait for Jesus to come back. Jesus is coming back. I hope he hurries the fuck up and he better work. Oh, it's written into the Bible. One third of the ocean's dying. One third. Oops, missed that one. Oh, you know, Jesus, this, what, 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 I mean, I love all these guys that talk to, Jesus never wrote the fucking Bible, he's got nothing to do with the Bible, which version? Jesus was poor, fucking the foot washer, with the fucking whip, throwing the money changers for Kevin Blanche, I walked through the valley of the shadow of death, I feel no evil. It's a giant fucking story coming out of Mexico. He says it perfectly, he says it perfectly. It's a hot water current. Coming from Japan, the swiftest rivers in the world. Japanese current into the California current. And it's hot. 
Let's go to the Olympics. Dr. Ralph Lauren's got white jackets for opening ceremony that say cooling jackets. <laughs> no running, no jumping, no fucking... Nursing mothers can go, though. Nursing mothers, come kill your fucking baby. No fans, no prep. And by the way, Colin Kaepernick, he's no fucking Carlos. He's no Tommy Smith. Nike contract? My grandson the other day was doing something. I says, well, the shoes you got, those little slaves in that bunker that they genocide in China, those little children's slaves, their fingers probably were bleeding a little bit and couldn't quite get them in the hole. Not me. Not me. I'm not participating. You can participate. I'm not. Fuck these fuckers and their slave-made goods. Put me in, coach. Giant fucking story. Oh, I'm Dutch Sense. My YouTube site goes crazy because I said, <laughs> Fukushima's a hoax. Nothing happened there. And Pacific Ocean's fine. I'll never forget it. I'm walking the coast of California in 2015. I'm out of Gorda. I'm out of work. Water. Fly down a fish cop. Come over there. We start talking. He's the guy that California fucking wildlife. He takes care of the ocean right there. What about the ocean? Never seen it so healthy. I'm like, wait a minute. You need to get the fuck out of your truck. What are you talking about? Never seen so healthy. Fuck, what about, I've been walking the whole coast. These tide pills are deader than fuck. And he's like, well, I do pick up a lot of debris from Fukushima. In the early days of Fukushima in 2013, 14, 15, they had crews, black op crews that would come along. I videoed lots of them, put them on YouTube, they'd take them down. Fucking, as I was walking, a lot of times I didn't have things. I'd sleep under the underpasses, I would fucking, wherever. I'd watch them, they'd come in and the black ops operator had a little helicopter and they'd come in and they had these detectors they'd put up under the horror pass. And I videoed several of them that took them down, the videos. And they'd pick up the debris. And they were monitoring. They had two fucking big weather balloons out here at fucking Energy Solutions. I'd put them up, videos on that, take them down. No copyright says just take them down. Radnet dishes, they're turning down at Weber State University when they crashed them. Videoed that, took it down. No copyright says just took it down. Shadow banding on Balco on chemo. I'm going to go Pedro Guerrero Jr. on this one. Oh, good shot. Fuck that, I'm going to go 1974 All-Star Game, Reggie Jackson. Knock the cover off that one. Huge story. Thank you, in Mexico. This fisherman for saying it. Knock the fucking Ohio nuclear reactor out. You gotta get a bell out, baby. Okay. They could build a factory right here and say, hey, we're gonna build a factory and we're gonna take, you know, eight, six, five, four, three year olds and we're gonna kill them and tear their organs out, but it's gonna employ fucking many thousands of people. Fuck, you better put it here. We need jobs, 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 jobs. So it rained for exactly 33 seconds here today in the monsoon. Big story. Thank you, Mexico. Fucking Belgium reactor's got a fucking hydrogen leak. That's all. Just so. Uh, maybe we can call him Arnie Gundershiel and his wife that used to be the spokesperson for the NEI. Where's the NEI news when you need her? Huh. Nuclear power. Hell of a way to boil a fucking planet. The Great Pacific Genocide. The heat bubble over the western United States. Great Salt Lake's right there. It's right there. It's kind of fucking dry. Just predicted by Kevin Blanche. Nuclear energy. Hell of a way to boil an ocean. Kevin Blanche.
2011. This is going to cause, this fucking, it's going to be the hottest heat, so they're lying, they're lying, these full blown out melt, that's never happened before. These cores are going to fucking burn in the Pacific Ocean, they're going to cause a heat source unforeseen in the history of mankind. It's going to break the chain. It's going to break the fucking food chain. It's going to wipe out the fucking starfish. It's going to spike fucking cancer. It's going to cause a heat bubble over the western United States. It's going to cause the Great Salt Lake to go fucking dry. It's going to fucking cause the fucking salmon to collapse, the Chinook salmon in 2016. It's going to collapse the steelhead to collapse immediately. So this is going to be the greatest ecological catastrophe in human history. And they're going to go in cover-up mode. They're going to lie. They're going to cheat. They're going to control the media. Not in Japan. Here in the United States. The day they announced the fucking Olympics of Fukushima or Japan, I went psycho. I said, there'll never be fans there. But we were just talking about me and another guy. We, he says, remember when we, fuck, we, me and you, both said there'll never be fans there. It'll never happen. COVID-19 from the sea. No doubt in my mind. Fukushima, Fukushima, Fukushima. Remember that Bear Monsanto radio roundup settlement? Boy, COVID worked out nice for Bear, didn't it? Worked out nice. The scientists, they're mystified, they're baffled, they're puzzled, they're stumped, they're perplexed, they're bewildered. That's not science. Kevin Blanche, probably the greatest scientist fucking ever. Definitely the, you know, the greatest fucking marine biologist in history. <laughs> Play back the tape, Your Honor. First you hypothesize the knowledge. What I just said. These meltdowns are going to cause all this. Then you do field work, at least four and a half years. Over 10. Then you defend your work against this tsunami. These truths. Put me in a rubber room, me and Semmelweis. Fucking, fucking little invisible germs. They don't fly through the air. They kill people. Okay, okay. Fucking. He said it perfectly. I've been saying it. How many videos have I done saying that? They're into the fucking current. Japanese current. Into the California current. He said it perfectly. This is fucking hot water that's in a current that started in Japan. All the way to boiling ocean. The Great Pacific Genocide, as I named it very early. Anybody? Oh, I'm Dutch Sense. <laughs> what a hoax. Everything's great. 77. Fuck that fucking derelict. Cobra Report. Ha. Fuck anybody who fucking disenfranchised themselves away from the Fukushima dynamic. Whoop. Anybody that stayed with it. Whoop. You're down to me, baby. Shadow banning on Balco on chemo. That's all right. Fucking try to put my toothpaste back in a toothpaste. <laughs> try to fucking put this lightning back in a fucking... It wasn't Pandora's fucking box. It was a bottle. Oh, they shattered the fucking bottle. What about the 8-8 disaster on the White Sea? What about the ongoing fucking meltdown that's going on in China? Not a word by lamestream media. Not a word by the vloggers and bloggers. <laughs> Fucking put me in coach. I'm ready to play. See in Monterey for the Olympics. I'll be there for opening ceremony. World record holder. Dead tide pool jumping. Bob Beeman Blanche. Stay tuned.